already rolling. I used to always think that bisexuality was like a stepping stone uh, to, you know, coming out as gay and that the people that claim to be bisexual were just too afraid of coming out as gay. And I look back at myself and I just think, what an arrogant little shit, ignorant little shit I must have been. And how disgraceful it was for me to be part of this LGBT plus community that I thought in this really, really outdated, backward way. A lot of people still think that bisexuality is not a genuine sexual orientation. And I used to think this way. I've often wondered why I've thought this way. And I guess maybe because I'm attracted to only one gender. Some people being attracted to both just doesn't compute for me. Or I guess even with bisexual men in particular, they're attracted to men, which I can identify with. But the fact that they're attracted to women as well, I just completely can't understand that. And that's what's led to me thinking, oh, well, they're actually gay. And then that is the actual reason that it dawned on me as to why I'm probably thinking this way. I have no way ever to be in their shoes because I am not attracted to two sexes, whereas they are. So therefore I have no reason or no right to judge them on that because I have absolutely no idea what it is like to be a bisexual person. Does that make sense? And then the fact that I would tell them like, oh, you know, one day you might be gay. That's just like, that's like a homophobic person coming up to me and telling me who I'm attracted to. I hate it. So therefore, why am I being biphobic towards bisexual people? The weirdest part about all this is the fact that the people that are generally saying it are very accepting of non-heterosexual sexualities. That's a bit of a mouthful. But I still have this sly undertone of like, oh, but you'll be gay one day and that's, that's fine. No, they're attracted to both genders and we are in no position to judge them and to tell them who they're attracted to because we cannot understand what it is like to be bisexual if you are not bisexual. Thankfully, my backward thinking is years ago and I've since educated myself. And when I went to Stockholm in Sweden recently, I made friends with a very attractive bisexual guy. And he was really nice. He showed me around Stockholm a lot, took me to Stockholm Pride, which was very, very fun. Lots of reenactments of ABBA. And we had a few really great conversations around bisexuality and it's amazing to hear how many people still say to him, oh, you'll be gay one day, you know, all that sort of thing. And it may seem like an innocent thing to say, but you are actually being so biphobic and rejecting them fundamentally as a person. However, what does this say about us? Can we blame individual people for thinking this way? Honestly, I don't think so. I think it's more of a societal issue. It's about the society that we're growing up in, how we're educated or how we're not educated. Except for myself, I blame myself. Always blame myself for things, because I should know better. So this is my part to share with you. Bisexuality is a thing. It is the B in LGBT+, okay? It's there, it exists. If someone tells you they are bisexual, they are sharing something so important about themselves to you. <clears throat> Just like if someone tells you that they're gay, or transgender, or asexual, whatever it may be, you need to accept and support them. And who knows, you may learn a thing or two about yourself and about your own perspective on life. Have any of you had this outdated view of bisexuality and since educated yourself? Or have you always been accepting of bisexuality? Let me know below and or if you are a bisexual and you wanna share a personal experience, you feel comfortable enough, write it in the comments and let's have a little discussion down there. And until next time, that's a wrap. Oh, 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 oh,